The following video will explain the layout of the course Introduction to Algebra and the course is located at this web address freedomuniversity.tv slash courses slash intro to algebra. And if you're viewing this on YouTube you can see that there's a hyperlink in the description box. Okay here we have our home address for the step-by-step -step video course in Introduction to Algebra and you can see here that there are six modules they're entitled as follows real numbers and their properties for module one module two is equations problem solving and inequalities module three is graphs of linear equations inequalities and applications module four is exponents and polynomials and module five is factoring Finally, we have Module 6, which deals with roots and radicals. Now, the course description for the set of videos describe as follows. It covers the basic arithmetic operations on sign numbers as well as covering concepts about symbols and its notation, solutions of linear and quadratic equations, and finally, the course covers factoring, powers, and elementary graphing. So let's uh, look at module one. We'll start off with that. Okay, so you here you have the six modules I discussed earlier. Here we have module one, real numbers and their properties. So on the left side is basically a table of contents. And on the left side is where the video is displayed as you click on this link. So for example, when you click on translating algebraic expressions, you get the video here. It's going to take some time to load up and when you see this finally uh, has a nice white where you can press the play button now for today, you have the video starting off now this is kinda small so what you can do is right click into after you press the play button zoom so let's start and then the zoom the full example. screen and see the entire video in this way now to get out of this video you press the escape button found on your computer and you're back to this presentation or display so let me pause this right now and go to the rest so you can see here you have a minus sign which means it expanded and then you can uh, compress it I mean with the minus sign with a plus and then minus you can expand it when there's a minus it's already expanded and then the minus says you can compress it when you press it so here these contain hyperlinks so here in module one you have an introduction to algebra you got the real numbers and then you got the real numbers in the last section but this is more in finding additive inverse absolute numbers adding fractions with different signs subtracting real numbers adding and subtracting real numbers and application of real numbers that concludes this module in module two you have a follow similar format okay so here this module is entitled equations problem solving and inequalities here you have addition and subtraction properties multiplication and division properties linear equations let me widen this up so you can see it a little bit we have applications involving solving integer general and geometry problems we can find more applications associated with motion mixture and investment problems this is an important area that you should be comfortable with since you're going to deal with those in real life and how to invest the income you'll earn in your job formulas and applications in geometry and then finally conclude with properties of inequalities module three involves graphs of linear equations inequalities and properties and you can adjust the width of the table of contents as I shown here and here the first module is line graphs, bar graphs, and additions. From there we talk about linear equations where we graph it in two variables. Then we graph lines using intercepts that includes plus horizontal and vertical lines. Then we talk about the slope of a line plus parallel and perpendicular lines. Graphing lines using points and slopes then finally applications of equations of line then module 4 consists of exponents and polynomials where once we discuss these you'll finally conclude with this as a special products of polynomials after 
you get used to what are exponents in terms of product quotient and power rules, integer exponents. Then we talk about the application of exponents based on the concept of scientific notation. Then we introduce the concept of polynomials where we learn how to add and subtract and then multiply. Module 5 with factoring where we find common factors, introduce that concept. And then we know how to group factors. Then we find and factor quadratic equations, one where the leading coefficient of this x squared term is equal, either equal to 1 or doesn't. So as x here is 1 where a is equal to 1, which is equal x squared plus b x plus c. Then we factor squares of polynomials, and then we have a general factoring strategy. Then we solve the quadratic equations by factoring, like these equations where we set them equal to 0. And then we see some of the applications associated with quadratics. Then finally, our last module deals with roots and radicals, where we try to find the roots. And then we deal with the multiplication and division of radicals, as well as the addition and subtraction, and then how we simplify radicals. And again, this is associated with roots. So that concludes this introduction to algebra, consisting of six modules. You can get back to the home page to see what they are again. And that concludes this basic introduction and how these series of videos are presented.